What's up? Y'all know this is Ari. If you don't know, hey, how you doing? Welcome to my channel. Let me give you a little overview. I do what I want over here. And you can catch me on a good day, bad day. I'm going to be me all day. So, let's talk about what been going on. Last time y'all seen me, I, I, was just, I was just out of it. I am a Jeep owner. Clearly, you can tell. And I took my whole top off, okay? I was out here, boobs out, show out. And we are having Florida weather. So if you don't know about Florida weather, because I used to be down there in the summer, it'd be like super hot, hot. And all of a sudden, you'll get these little storms. Storms will last for like 30 minutes. Never had that up here. I live in Ohio, okay? For the past week, it's been 100 degrees. Um, it's going on two weeks now. I'm kind of sweating. And let me tell you something. I took the top off, been riding for a whole week. I called my brother over and I was like, hey, can you help me put my back? portion on my jeep one so he helped me i showed y'all in a couple clips prior to we was out here boobs out show out i didn't put the front on and i went to work and i said oh by the time i get off of work i can put it on because i had them in the back of my car but it was like a hundred and some degrees it was burning butt cheeks out so i did all that to say it poured down raining for 30 minutes my car was wet wet i mean wet soaking wet puddle so i had to drain the car i had to wipe everything off i took it to the car wash stole a couple of them towels they be having to clean this car my seats are not they don't stink thank god because i know some people are like oh, i got carpet in the stinking here mines don't because i have um matte protectors the real good ones you know the ones cost like a hundred dollars a piece so i got out of them i ordered a lift because at the time i was like i don't know if i want the lift or if i want the uh What's the thing they got the the lift thing that goes into your uh to your like your garage or shed so you can like pull it manually or you can get the crank and you just sit on it and you crank it up. I clearly feel like I'm not I got the the pulley the one the manual one and I set it up and it works really fine. That's only seventy five dollars. The crank one is six hundred and something odd dollars. I ordered from Amazon. I just took it back. Long story short. I didn't even, I did not even unwrap it, okay? Didn't do none of that. Just left it like it was. Burned the box breaker. That box is about 100 pounds. Poor little me. I ain't been to the gym. I ain't lifted nothing. I brought that box in there. I can lift 135 pounds because y'all know I can do it. But let's explain how this lady in UPS thought I was going to lift this fucking box up and put it on a weight thing for her. She said, oh, do you want, uh, can you help me lift this up? I said, no. I said, you need to get a worker in here. I just struggled to bring this in here, so I'm definitely not struggling to lift this up. Not even that. She wanted me to lift the bottom part of the box up. Excuse my language. Bitch, <coughs> I don't think so. I don't work here. I'm off duty. So that's what I need to tell you. Now, we're going to continue on with this vlog. We're about to go to the shop. <laughs> and we're about to do some work. I just had to tell y'all that before I forget, because people really be testing me. All colors, shapes, and sizes be testing me, and I be have to let them know. I'm not one or two or three. I'm not even in the lineup, okay? So I don't know why you pointing me out when I'm over here minding my business. But we're going to get to the shop, and I'm going to show you what we got coming up, and I got to promote some things. So this is a work day. Follow me, and let's get it started. All right, guys, so we was in here making candles, and this is the back scene of making candles. Got the whole, ooh, yeah. And let me see what scent she wrote down. Okay, she got like a little cute scent, but these are mines over here that I made. And that's called working. <laughs> Alright, so today for our little meal situation, we're going to get it started by roasting a bunch of vegetables and cooking them so that that can be our main meal. So I'm just going to go over the vegetables that I have today and we're going to roast them, okay? So starting off right here, we have a sweet potato. I just have one giant sweet potato. I am going to actually leave the skin on here and just cut the sweet potato up. You want to make sure you have a sharp knife because if you do not have a sharp knife, you're not going to be able to cut this bad boy up. <clears throat> then we have some baby, um, like, 
Russell potatoes. I like the little ones. They taste way better than the I, the big ones. So these are the baby Russell potatoes. And then over here, I have my little garden of what we're going to be eating. And I have some bell peppers. I have yellow and orange, which um, the color ones are like a more sweeter. And then we have some radishes. If you have never tried a radish, you should try it out. It's really good when you roast them and you put the seasoning on them. And then we have our onions. And you can use whatever onion. I just use the yellow ones. Because I just think the yellow ones taste good when you roast them. And then I have a cast iron pan right here. And I just line it with some aluminum foil. Our base that we're going to use for this is olive extra virgin olive oil which is this right here you can use um grapeseed oil which is a good combination as well and then i'm going to go down the seasonings that i'm going to be using on here so i'm going to use some black pepper i'm going to use some adobo it's all seasoning it has the garlic and all that good stuff in there i like the green cap for this purpose i'm going to use the butter steakhouse I know it says butter steakhouse, but this tastes really, really good on vegetables. It gives that buttery taste so that you putting all that butter in there. And then we're going to use some garlic salt. Is it granulated salt? Yeah, I think it is. It's garlic salt. We're going to need a little bit, but if you have garlic powder, it's better for you. And that's all we're going to use. So I'm going to go ahead and start dicing everything up. Everything's going to be diced. You do not want to um, change the format. So since these are my smallest I'm just going to half them and roast them and everything's going to be about this size. Come on, spill the tea. Yeah. season all our food up we have cut everything the radishes the sweet potatoes the golden yukon um potatoes the yellow onion and the bell pepper i only did one bell pepper because we have a lot going on and i just didn't want to oversaturate um everything so now we're just going to put the extra virgin olive oil in here and you just want to drizzle a little bit it does not need to be oversaturated with a bunch of oil because again, this is supposed to be a healthy meal, okay? So then we're gonna take some of our pepper. I love um, black pepper, okay? If you get the white pepper, <laughs> even better, but I love black pepper, so. At your discretion, do what you do. Then I'm gonna take the adobe all purpose seasoning and I'm just gonna go in there and layer it, okay? Then I'm going to take my Kinder's uh, buttery steakhouse and I'm just going to layer that too. Oops, don't, get, don't get wild and crazy. And then I'm just gonna put a little bit of this garlic salt because I wish I had garlic pepper, but we gotta do what we gotta do. Okay, and then you're gonna take um, a fork or spoon or whatever you're going to mix this with and just make sure you coat everything in the olive oil and the seasoning, okay? So we did spray a little bit of the olive oil at the bottom before we started this process and then we drizzle a little bit on top so that it's going to get us all its goodness. Now once you mix this up and you get it all together, if you would like you can put like a little bit of water to steam it in here. Um, some people do that just to get it soft and tender not a lot of water just a little bit because it's just going to steam it and then it's going to start roasting it off 
So what I'm going to do after I get everything mixed in here really well, it looks like everything, everybody done got a little bit of all the seasoning. I'm going to set my oven to 375, you can do 400, and then we're going to let this cook for about an hour and a half to two hours. It just depends on how chunky you cut everything, like this right here, I cut it real chunky. I should have cut this down, but it's going to be okay. So I might go for two hours max, minimum hour and a half. And that is the meal. Good morning guys, welcome to Art Infinite. And this is a new vlog. So, we got a lot going on today. Some very interesting, fun stuff going on today. And I'm gonna give y'all a rundown. So we just got done prepping our food to eat. Um, I got something to tell y'all. I be really upset about it, but I'm gonna have to tell y'all. <laughs> I don't know if I wanna tell y'all. We're gonna, we're gonna work out. I put some makeup on today. Um, I'm looking very like, um, where is the rest of your face set? It looks very bland because I got this hat on. But we got some things we got to do today. So, this is my first time. I'm going to tell y'all right now. This is my first time going to a concert by myself. Ah! So, we're going to do a transformation today. Um, I do not know how I'm going to wear my hair because I got to get some jam. I do not know what I'm going to wear because I'm not buying no clothes for this. And on top of this, um, I'm going to have a good time. But before we start all that action, I just got done prepping food. Now, I just need to go ahead and go to the shop because I got to go work a little bit. And then once I get done working, I have two clients. I have one client, two things I got to do. Well, two clients. Um, I had to do a pedicure and a manicure. That's going to be simple and easy. Then I got to stock some stuff up because I'm having a candle, one-on-one -on -one candle making class. So some of my stuff came in yesterday. I need to put that up. And then on top of that, I need to go to the hair store, give me some gel for my hair. And then by the time all that's said and done, I want to be leaving the house. I want to be on the highway by 6 o'clock because the concert starts at 8. It's an hour drive. Well, it's like a 45, well, I'm going to drive, it's going to be a 45 minute drive. But I want good parking and I want to go to the set, concession stand and I want to give me a little drink and I want to enjoy myself. Now, this is my first time going. I got a couple people that I know that do this all the time by themselves. And they're like, girl, you're going to have so much fun. So, just enjoy yourself. Do what you're going to do. Um, be safe. Like, I know the area. We go down there all the time when me and my family. I done been down there by myself and hung out, kicked it, did things, and came back. But I'm not a night driver, okay? I don't... Listen, I'm waiting on my night and shiny armor to come through and just drive me around because I get tired of driving. I'm not a night driver. Um, now, I kick it with you if you're driving. But to me, at night driving, I know it's not, I'm not interested. So, this is why it's going to be a challenge. I got to keep my ass up. I got to be up, okay? I know I'm going to be up because of the concert. I can't take my camera in there, but I can bring my phone in there and whatnot. I'm going to show you how to fit, but we got to go because we're like five minutes running behind. And I got to get to going. So, yeah. I did kind of like a light makeup. It's like 100 degrees outside. Um, and I just wanted to see what this makeup was going to do. It gives me a little orange. But it gives me like full coverage. But not really like, oh, you got makeup on. So, I'm going to test that out. And then if I like it, I'll come back later on. And do my eyelash and stuff like that. But I just did like a little, a little, little, little something. And I sprayed my face up. So. Yeah, let's get on the road. We got some work to do, but today is an adventure, so let's go. <laughs> started we got a couple things to do before our first client come in and that being said I gotta get to the business so I have to finish some candle orders take my purse off I have to finish some candle orders I had 
um, two people come in and make candles and we're doing wickless candles and the rest of my shipment came in so they can come pick up their candles today because I know my warmers were coming in so they made their candles right here I just need to go take my hot torch on top of them to get the indentions out and you can tell that we did it the right temperature because you have no um, no which color right now so I'm gonna label them package them up for them get them together and then on top of that I need to oven this up it's a little toasty in here so we're just waiting on the air to cool the place down i probably end up shutting this door so that we can get this place cool down a little faster because maybe it's a little hot in here it's a little hot in here so i probably have to open up my uh, little shade thing hey, what's on my neck i have to open this up because it's a little hot we need we need all the air. We need this room to cool down. And then I'll be back with y'all after I show you my little packaging and everything. Because I'm going to go live on Facebook and Instagram. So if you're not following me on Instagram, go ahead and do that. And you can get more information about what's going on. It's Ari underscore Infinite 33 over there. I try to share, post a lot of things. But I do forget. Do not blame it on my heart. Blame it on my mind. Because I do have a lot going on. But today, we got a busy schedule. And right now we need to cool this room now because it is hot so i'll catch y'all in a little bit all right guys so i got dressed Ooh. and um i got myself together and whatnot so i'm gonna show you what i got on dang it i should have put y'all on my tripod no needs to worry we'll work this out okay so oh you don't worry i'm gonna show y'all a little quick synopsis Ooh, don't fall down that's what we don't want you to do why you get on here can't get yourself together okay so the top is from old navy um y'all see when i did a haul and i bought all the colors at old navy because this was so just soft fitting and i like it and it's like a crop top situation but you know whatever and then i got this skirt from old navy y'all remember when i bought that from old navy it's really cute it's a skirt you didn't know it had shorts under it so it's really cute um target was selling these oh navy had it on sale for ten dollars okay get into it really cute and then my shoes y'all know steve mattens love them i always come through with the steve mattens legs by jesus <laughs> body and so so yeah so i got dressed i had my hair in the top bun i'm not taking this off until i get in the garage about to get out the car walk in do my want to because i had to buy some jam for 17.99 <laughs> because i'm natural and when natural people know what the situation is normally that's why you see me with a cap or if i do slick back my hair it's braids for like 10 days and then i can do a little something i had to wash it this morning so that is the outfit that I have on. Oh, really cute. I just wanted y'all to get into it. Really cute again. I love the shoes. Really cute. So hopefully we got a good. Oh, slow row. Slow motion. Slow motion. Slow motion. Do I got a stain on my skirt? No. Slow motion. Slow motion. Slow. All right. So the rest of this vlog will be on my um, camera because boys and girls i'm not even taking y'all in because we're not gonna have these problems i already know situation they don't let y'all in we're not gonna even try to take y'all we're not gonna put y'all on my shirt we're not doing none of that so i catch y'all on the phone all right
morning y'all so this is the next day after the concert i put some pictures right here to show you what your girl look like <laughs> show you the video <laughs> i had so much fun like i've never been to a concert by myself never um i ain't never done nothing like that by myself but it was fun the girls that i was somebody out was like a group of girls they were really really cool and we had fun and we was dancing and, and singing along and she was taking pictures of her friend and then we was talking and laughing and giggling so, so i had a good time and i'm back at home um so let me tell you when i got there i parked in the wrong parking lot i got so excited because i was like an hour early and i'm like oh my hour early they had all these functions going on and i'm like oh i'm gonna go sightsee and then go to my event because i knew where the event was at but the way parking is down there it's so many parking lots parking garage you park in one garage and you think you right there you're on a whole nother side so i parked in the garage because i was so excited parking is 15 dollars which is okay everybody know parking's like 15 20 30 dollars 15 dollars is cool i done paid up to 30 dollars for parking so I got where I was going and I get out and then I look at my thing. I don't know why I thought it said second second street. It said race street. Street was just stuck in my mind. So I'm like, okay, I'm there. I walk up. Yeah, I'm at the baseball field. And I said, no, this is not where I want to be. So I walk and as I'm walking, people are like, oh, you cute, you beautiful. Okay, because it was like parades, festivals, and lights going on. Like, slip, slip. Okay, let's back it up. I realized that I was like, six seven minutes away from where i need to be no way i got in my car and i went to the right parking garage and then i told the lady it was like i just parked out in the parking wrong garage and, and she felt sorry for me because i did put that on i put that on that i was i was really like i needed help so she actually let me in there she got out of the booth lifted up and let me in there. i said oh thank god another 15 i got it so she let me in there so that was cool or whatever um i got in there everything was cool like garage the center got in there cool whatever have fun and um i'm just telling y'all what happened because i didn't bring y'all in there but i did got photos i listen i'm an amateur photographer if you need a real photographer for you holla at me 1-800-RE-INFINITE i'm there for you so that's what said got home at 12 went straight to bed now this is the sad part and i'm gonna close out this video this vlog because um right now i'm dealing with family issues someone in my family custody has passed away and this is my homie i'm gonna show him right here my mom decided for my homie i love him he was so much fun so sometimes y'all would see me in vlogs and y'all would see a different atmosphere because i'd be at his house and um we're dealing with that situation today and i probably won't be back on here for a while because we just we're taking it easy my mom she's taking it hard and that's why i look a little rough because we was up six this morning <laughs> and i'm just now getting back home and y'all know i don't have my watch so it's about no it's a it's really new <laughs> it's really new so yeah so i just want to let y'all know i have fun if you've never been to a concert by yourself try it out try that oh now stay in your area don't don't go to two different states over but try it out it's really fun and baby i'll be doing that annually okay so i'll catch y'all later coming back in a week or so i'll probably get it just imagine that you're not there because that's not what we want <laughs> we want the the bracket because i know i got that chair in the garage that i have not put up yet so yeah we're gonna go little playhouse okay y'all know we at my favorite store Ooh, give me some light so we at my one of my favorite stores Looking around to see if they got anything new. Anything new. And if they do. Uh, that's what you want. I was talking about we. So yeah. I got like a little personal air conditioning. But yeah. We're just looking around. See what they have. And then. It looks like nothing. But then once I figure it out, I'll be back. Yeah, don't have to got anything. Yeah, so y'all know I've been 
on the hunt for skates. They got rollerblades. So if they have rollerblades, I know good well they got some skates out here. <sighs> and they might be my size. So you come out here, get a TV stand. I'm trying to show you all the good stuff this week. What is this stainless inner pot? It's for something. Got a little tea set back there. This is like a little drill for beginners. If you're an apartment owner, first time home owner. They got this. Speaker set. You get your vacuum for 37. That's not bad. What's a laser vacuum cleaner? Okay. But again, we're out here looking for what? Skates. Mm, let's get a little dirt in my eye. What is this? Wake up light lamp change color. All right, when I find what I'm actually looking for or something good, I'll be back to let y'all know. But it's a lot. Oh, hold on before we leave. These chairs are cute. But why is all the chairs really low? These are cute chairs. I like them. It's pretty low. Okay. I'll call you back when I find something good. If I know how to open this, I'm opening. Okay. So it's the C clamp stand stand. And this is gonna be a part of the new channel that we're gonna have, which is gonna be able to help us um view stuff a little better. Oh shoot. So it comes with a couple different legs or stands, which are these. And they're able to do like multitask. Oh, this is cool. So this goes on the table. Okay. So hold everything together. So I'm gonna try to do like a little demonstration right now. So y'all can see. And then I'm gonna use my other camera so y'all can see it put on here. So how wide do it open? Okay, let's see. Cause my table's kind of thick. So I got this off of Amazon because we're gonna be doing um, our infinite <laughs> reviews and the reviews are just like whatever random stuff I like if it's um, nail polish nail stuff feet things like that so we're gonna be reviewing it and that channel will be coming out but I was like why not just show you all the stuff that I'm getting I've been waiting on this for past three days cuz okay so this would not be a good table because it has like two different ledges I mean it's like two um little ledges I got going on but say for instance this was the part of the chair so it's pretty thick the part of the table and we just screw it back on here like so and it can be placed on pretty much anything that has a a little hole to it so I would do that first and then it really don't tell you what it does I mine so you stick this one in here and you would tighten it and then these are 360 so you just unscrew it or they 180 so they go back and forth and you just take it and you just screw it on there i guess you would just screw it on there like so nope yep you just tighten it on there the arm and i got this one because they got the ones like the little spring arms to it but them don't seem too uh, sturdy. And I have a thick camera, a heavy camera. So we ain't got time to be dropping no camera, okay? Mm -hmm. And as we build it, I'm just gonna show y'all, okay? So it goes pretty tall. Pretty tall. And then I can just like pull it down or whatever. And you can make it as tight as you need to. 
So you just tighten up the little bolts so it won't move. And if you need to release it, you can do it like that. And then they give you a couple different anchor pieces to it. So the different anchor pieces, this is for the camera. And you also can hook up a mic, so this is like for the camera. And then they give you this piece right here, you know, if you have a phone or if you record on your phone, you can do the phone piece. This is like universal for everybody. And then they give you some couple extra pieces, so if you have like a mic or if you have a GoPro or whatever, you can use them as well. So I'm going to show y'all the purpose of this because we're about to start doing reviews. So I'm going to get my camera out. The camera that I bought for my birthday for Christmas, y'all. <laughs> that I have used but a couple times. Like when I did a couple um, cooking channels, cooking vlogs, this camera. So I don't take it out unless I use it for home or something like that. So underneath here, we're going to take this one and okay, stick it right there and screw it on like so and I got the whole shin shindig with this camera so this camera with everything to it the mic the little the handheld situation everything you know that that costs a little pretty penny then I'm gonna unscrew this part right here right quick and I'm kind of like show y'all And we're just trying to see if this is like really heavy enough to hold. Is this sturdy enough to hold this camera? Okay. And I think it is. Okay, so the little ball joint. Okay. Let me see. Let me show you. Let me show you. Let me, let me see you now. Cause this camera is heavy okay hi <laughs> you don't have to put all three of the sticks or all three of the um bars on there but for extended purposes you can put them on there so if you have like a table or something this is really heavy so this heavy duty you get one two three extended bars and i think this even extends a little bit more out i just didn't do it and um you can just move it how you want to as far as recording so i think this is really cute and you can just move it this way so if you're like a one person man band this really works so yeah i'm liking this y'all and then you could tighten that up or whatever i just loosen it because i wanted to see but yeah we'll start doing reviews and this is my setup um not per se this in this area but i wanted y'all to see what i bought so if you like want to start doing reviews and you're like what do they be using or how they use it this is a c clamp stand and i ordered off of amazon okay so when i get started getting paid then i'll start linking stuff but till then you find your own but yeah so this is what we're gonna be using i want to let y'all know that okay today's been a work day so we're gonna go to work we're gonna show some feet do some things and hopefully y'all like the new channel if you do make sure you subscribe like and share turn on your notification and make sure you watch my weekly vlogs because the weekly vlogs i'll be talking stuff and we had so much fun but this one is more review talking stuff so you're not gonna really see my face all the time you might see it periodically hopefully you like it and i'll catch y'all later all right guys